Hey everybody, this is a super quick video that has literally nothing to do with anything else I've posted, but it's just something I had to get off my mind because I'm kind of disgusted with people right now. I hate to say that because I'm usually like super about helping everyone succeed, but I am really sick of a trend I'm seeing and I, I just feel like I have to voice my opinion on it and move on. Women, what the hell is up with us right now? Why are we attacking each other for like no freaking reason? Like every video I go on, and I'm watching a lot of videos just to kind of learn about YouTube because I don't really know what I'm doing. And it seems like every single it, like commentary, it's like none of it's constructive. For example, I was watching a haul video and I went down to read the comments just because I'm curious, like what do people receive? Like I'm trying to like understand how that works. So I went down and oh, this made me so mad. Obviously a woman had watched this video of this other girl and they had not liked a shirt that she had purchased. They didn't like the way it fit on her body, didn't like the color, whatever it was, they didn't like it. So rather than saying, hey, insert vlogger name, I don't like your shirt, or I don't like that shirt, that shirt's not my taste, it's not something I would wear. Um, maybe even asking why did you pick it because I don't, I don't understand why you like it because I just don't like it that much. Instead, this person proceeded to be like, that shirt's ugly, you're ugly, you don't know what you're doing, you're stupid. I don't know why anybody follows uh, follows you. You should get a life. And I just was reading this and I was like, this is terrible. Like, you don't like the shirt and here you are attacking this person's character because you didn't like one shirt that they like, they put in a haul video. And it just so happened, right as I was like realizing this, I went back to like the creator dashboard, whatever that thing is on YouTube where you look at your comments. And I saw that someone had done it to me. They're like, she needs to learn about fit. She needs to go to a tailor, blah, blah, blah. She's so stupid. And I was just sitting there going, you know nothing about me. Like, why is your like argument with me when your frustration is with the clothes? And so I just started thinking about this and I started watching more videos and reading more comments because I get a little bit pedantic about these things when I like discover trends because Fun fact, I'm a statistician, I have a master's in statistics, so I love like studying trends and like how things happen, so I got into that like tunnel vision data mode. So I started reading all these comments and all I could see is this huge trend of how women online react to things they don't like. Rather than coming to the conversation with a very logical arguments or statements of, a, of opinion about the thing that they are upset about, which could be the shirt, it could be someone's opinion, it could be all kinds of things. Instead, the immediate reaction is to attack the person's character. And this is weird because when I would read men's comments, it's very literal. Like men will attack you directly for what they don't like. So if someone doesn't like your body, they'll be like, mm, you're fat. And that's what they'll say, you're fat you're ugly, you should lose weight. All of those things are very like literal physical descriptions, which are something you can see from a video. But when a woman attacks somebody else online, it's very weird because all of the conversation is on character and on value and on worth. So there's a lot of commentary about like, you're a liar, nobody loves you, you're seeking attention, you're like all of these weird, like much more personal and much more angry comments. And all I could think it, as I was reading this is like, the reason we have problems aren't because of men, it's because we as women can't get our crap together and stop treating each other like we're, like our character is based on our like fashion choices or our makeup or what we did that day. It's insane to me that people feel so comfortable making such strong opinions about each other and we're better than that. Like we really, really should not be such idiots online and I don't know how to fix it. Like people say crap to me all the time and I guess I've become like numb to it because I'm exposed to so much crap and so much stuff that like, I sometimes don't even realize what people write because it's like, oh, I don't like that, delete. Like, I do, I just delete it because there's no point in keeping it out there for anyone else to read and feel crappy about themselves because some bonehead got on the internet and wrote something stupid. But, you know, I'm kind of signed up for this, I guess. Like, I know that putting myself out there isn't gonna expose me, but there's things like this that go on in real life. 
Like it's totally okay to when we don't like someone's physical worth as a woman to just attack everything about them. And it's making me like sick inside because I had hoped we'd moved on. I'd hoped we'd gotten somewhere better. And I think what's really weird to me, and this is my other part of this rant, is that it's totally wrong to do this stuff in person now. So if, if you're in public and someone yells out, that girl's wearing a shirt too tight, she's a terrible person, she's not admitting the truth about herself, she hates herself, she has no self-esteem to wear something like that. If someone yelled that out in public, People would be like, oh, I don't know that girl. That's a shame. I'm so sorry she said that to you. You should be able to wear whatever you want. And there would be this physical outpouring of um, shame. But when it happens online, everyone's okay with it. And that really bothers me. You know what it means? It means we're cowards. Because if you really feel that way, you should be able to say it when you aren't behind your account. And the truth of the matter is, we as women still get some type of weird, sick satisfaction of putting ourselves just a notch above another woman. If we can find somebody that's just a little bit lower than us in some weird measurement scale that we've invented in our head, that somehow that makes us better. That's totally screwed up and it makes me angry. But somehow, many women think that that's how we should operate. That we should constantly be in like some Olympic death match for popularity or for like worth. It's not even popularity, it's freaking worth. And it's, it's sickening, it's just wrong, it's broken. I don't know, it's a really pedantic rant. Everybody's probably gonna hate it. I don't even care, I don't even care. You know what, stop being mega bitches to each other. It's so weird to me that women of all ages feel completely comfortable doing this. And the worst is, is sometimes they pass it off like they're doing someone a favor. Hey, I just insulted the crap out of you cause, cause I cared about you. Uh-uh, party foul, not cool. Seriously. So here's what I'm gonna ask you guys to do. I don't ever ask you guys to do anything in my videos, but I'm gonna ask you to do something. If you watch this video and you agreed that all of this is bullshit, go find a way to compliment a woman on something you do like about them. And if you must provide criticism, make it constructive. Don't result to insults on someone's character when your complaint has nothing to do with who that person is, more a choice they made that you may not agree with. Okay, I have nothing else to say today. It was just a quick rant, because I was mad about this. You know, data's still really sick, and so maybe I'm a little bit more disgruntled than normal because I haven't been sleeping, because I've been getting up every couple hours to take care of him, both last night, and I have a feeling, mm, tonight as well. So, I guess I'm a little bit more on edge. These things bother me more, but seriously, guys, it makes me really sad. It makes me sad that this is a way like we're trained to treat each other like crap. I don't get it. I don't understand. And what I think is really terrible is when I think about myself, I've done it and I don't even know where it comes from. So I've got to get my shit together too. Like we all need to actively think about it because Passively, we've been trained to be idiots. We have. So, active minds change lives. That's the reality of it. Well, that's it, everybody. Have an amazing night. Sorry I went on and on and on about this very not so happy subject, but I think it's important. Have an amazing night, and I will check you on the flip side. Peace.